Hi, my name is Anna McMillan, the owner of Little Wink Sleep. Today we're going to talk about baby nests. Baby nests are a fantastic tool. They're a tool in our toolbox. However, they're not an always. We've got to look at what is healthy for baby in long term and what is safest. A lot of parents ask me if they can have a nest in their bed. What you'll find is that babies, especially when they come to that 10 to 12 weeks, will start to roll. This little bub here is six weeks, so she's not looking to roll, although could spontaneously roll. The majority of their weight is in their head. So if they roll, it is not safe for them to be up against the nest. And if you're not awake, we can't make sure that that doesn't happen. With the nest, babies love them because they've been curled up in the womb for that nine months. They like the coziness of them, so they can be a really great tool, especially in those late afternoon naps like we're doing right now. You can help your baby to sleep and pop them down in here, and putting them on the couch with your leg up against them so we make sure they don't fall off, or being right next to them is absolutely a great solution. Putting them on the floor in the nest while you have a shower just next to them is a great option as well. We want to make sure that baby is safe in it. If we're using this 24-7 all the time for sleep for baby when they're very, very little, then what can happen is that around 10 to 12 weeks, they can become uh, associated that when they need to go to sleep, then they need the nest. However, then it is not safe when they're rolling. Either way, the safety recommendations are to have nothing in the crib except for them and their soother. No bumpers or anything. So let's consider this like a tool. It's one of those options, especially when baby is struggling or you're having a nap downstairs in the lounge, that we can really use them. They're fantastic. However, are they an always thing? Not in my opinion. I hope you have a great rest. And remember, tools are fantastic. As parents, we need all sorts of tools for all sorts of ages with our babies. You know your baby best, and so we want to make sure we read those sleep cues and put them down just when they're ready.